picking Korea. Can on fleek put the pain onto Dread. And really waiting this one out, but the push is there. As he lands, he, there's that Rune Prism. Do they have the damage? He's going oh. in as the last spell comes out from Keep. So you're playing Metal Gear Solid, just trying to sneak around all the guards as nobody is able to hear off Fleek or hey, see you him in there. Surely now. Here we go. Okay, has the vision, but it's way too late as Ocean Drake. Yeah, we uh, we never we never went that far. We just, <laughs> we just ate him out of Oh, we're going. Okay, this is what Galio could do at the bottom side, but the Shen lands that to Sandra ult. Here it comes the Yukal, going to land it on to Joker as he's all alone. Four on one. That's not very fair. So would it come at 930, but Dread is going to be spotted up on the top side, and now he's ultra slow with the axe coming in. And Shen's there too, so see you later. They won't have access to the ability. Keen. I think he's the right person to pick up blue. Silas, we know, is not going to be using damage. Dread is top side. Hey! Okay, flashes into that one. It looks like the chase is still on, though. Let's get on to this one as Keen. Trying to trade back damage, but he's just going to get poked with the big sword. Getting side lane turrets down is one way to force that to be the game. Here we go. Dread does have a teammate this time around. He's going in on the ghost. There is that smite. The flash on in and the kick to the face. He's going to go down. Out. I believe they are playing tomorrow, SKT, so. I'll have to wait and see as the first axe is gonna land. Jelly forced to flash away, but in goes the Olaf. They wanna take that guy out, and there it is. Not pushing up, but of course he is really only a tanky boy. So he's best Swain impression on this World of Ages mid lane frontline mage. Sandbox take down the third Drake of the game, the first one soloed, and they're actually pushing forward as well. Wow, the flash forward. They want to get this rise down before he can do any damage. Silas in the back line trying to do something. Takes out the Aatrox. Here's Soul getting into that back line. Can anyone take him out? Yes, they can. The taunt is going to go down as Ghost doing way too much damage. And even though Yukal stays alive for a very long time, Silas, unfortunately, not sure if a Freak of Freeze can stop this Baron. Here comes the smoke. Yeah, Yukal. Okay, I'm going to hold that thought here as the Baron has started. Jelly trying to get that taunt down, but look at that Olaf just running at Dread right now as Jelly doesn't even exist in this one. We are going to have Yukal going in once again. It's going to flash away from that one, and finally, Keen does have a way to get into that back line. They're going to tip away at one. Still on the chase here, but the Chilling Smite looks like it might just be enough to stop out a bunch of DPS. And so Summit and on fleek feeling the brunt of that. Even Oh, oh, huge talk comes in from Joker. Can they follow this one up though? Jelly does have that aftershock as Yukal making his way in with the Stand United, but really nice stopwatch here as Jelly not able to find anything on the backside. At least Keen does trade a kill back onto the support, but that's about it. The bulldozer stops at from Yukal, but they're not going to actually fully commit to the Mountain Drake. Freaka not ready to just get on top of that one. Dread very slowly soloing it down. That allows Joker to come back. He's now getting in there, but Soul does have to back away. Look at Aatrox himself. He's going to go down one time, but Soul goes down. The huge damage of Afrika is no longer in the fight as you tell. Also going to be taken out here on the backside after that world enter. See if they can get on top of him. Looks like he might actually get away, but two kills are going to go the way of Sandbox here. They're still on the chase. Can they take out Yukal? Trying to actually get the GA on on fleek. Not really worth it to chase his Silas after all, as Keen somehow still alive on the backside. It's going to get interrupted. Up. See you later. Down you go, Rise. Not going to be able to survive this time around. Seeing what they can get. Just trying to force through as a three man unit. They do get the face check here, which is important for a freak up. We'll need to see the scoreboard to know about vision. Is this turning on to Joker for now? Here comes Tub over the wall, though. It's immediately taunted. Can he get anything down here? He tracks with a huge wombo combo into the back line. Soul's still alive, but it's not anything compared to Ghost and the damage that he does after that kind of engage. Well done by Sandbox. They're able to get two kills already on the backside. Looking for Soul here as well. He does a bunch of damage, but he is going to go down and not even get the Guardian Angel. Interruption. Sandbox got to be able to interrupt this one. And they're going to push on to perhaps the victory. Sandbox will win. And amazingly, Valdez, we were right on one prediction. We said Control Wards, Vision in the red blue side jungle would allow for a flank. It's the flank there. Dove gets in. And while he can't get everyone, they come from every angle.